people don't give girls enough credit. I'm in the ninth grade now, and the last time I studied a uniquely female narrative was in sixth grade. That might not seem like a lot, three years, but it is. Difference between 12 and 15, between girl and... We're reading To Kill a Mockingbird now, and I was walking home one day thinking about how Dill's hair was described as duck fluff, or how Scout viewed reading as breathing, or what I'd help my mom make for dinner when... I guess I was frowning a little, deep in thought. Um, someone... A man, a grown man, told me to smile, sweetheart. Strange, right? Telling some stranger to look happy? You know, it only takes one more muscle than smiling to punch someone in the teeth. Blood's better than tears, anyway. Action over thought, thoughts left lingering, wriggling through vital veins and organs when you try to fight something you know is bigger than you. The cudgel which has bludgeoned countless before, because if there's no struggle, then you lose the cold and broken hallelujah of... Well, at least you fought back. Don't tell sad girls to smile. Don't tell sad girls to smile because she might be the type who gets cut by hip bones. Don't tell sad girls to smile because she might still be trying to scrub someone else's sin from her skin. Hot water, holy water, it all flows under the same bridge eventually and the dead can only feel cold. So if she can feel the burning water, then maybe, maybe don't tell sad girls to smile because she does it for herself or someone she feels comfortable with. Not some slack-jawed, fish-eyed nice guy doesn't find a frown appealing. She might have a good reason to be sad, so don't you tell me to smile. It's not your mouth. It is not yours to kiss, to consume, to find comfort in when the windows rattle in a storm or your heart rattles in your rib cage like seeds in the dry earth, unable to grow without a little water and sunshine and tenderness. And if you really want a sad girl to smile, then you hold her until you're drenched in perfume from the gardens you planted in her heart so that every time her wounds reopen, she bleeds bouquets, but I'm not yours to hold. And if you keep walking around telling sad girls to smile, no one will ever want to be. And if you come any closer, I'll bite you and smile red.